Okay, Morphle. It's story time. Once upon a time, there was a mama duck whose eggs were about to hatch. When they did, little baby ducks came out. All of them were super cute and fluffy, except for one of the ducklings. It was different because it was big and red, and it didn't have any feathers. And instead of quacking, it sounded like this. Hey, there's a duckling! It wanted to play with its brothers and sisters, but they said it was ugly and they made fun of it. Mm. Yes, the brothers and sisters of the duckling were really mean. It made the duckling very sad. So sad that it flew off to play by itself. And when it was there by itself, all sad, all of a sudden, a giant dinosaur appeared. It chased the little duckling around. The little duckling flew for its life. There were big dinosaurs everywhere. Then it flew into the claws of a giant flying dinosaur called the pterodactyl. The little duckling was sure that the pterodactyl was about to eat it. But it didn't. Do you know why? No, Muffle, no, no. Because it was the duckling's real mother. You see, the duckling wasn't really a duckling. When it was just an egg, it accidentally rolled into the duckling's nest. The duckling grew larger and larger until it was just as big as its mommy. Oh, yeah! That's a good idea! So, the dino duckling went back to visit its mean brothers and sisters. And they were bullying a new duckling because it had big feet. Yeah! And the dino duckling roared really loudly and it chased away its mean brothers and sisters. And they lived happily ever after. The end. <laughs> Tapping test tubes, help! The Christmas present bandits use my time machine to steal a T-Rex from the past! <laughs> we are no longer the Christmas present bandits. Now, we are the Dino Bandits! Morpho, morph into a police car! <laughs> Not so tough now, eh? Now, this is our city! <laughs> 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 
Well, boys, welcome back to my city. Look, Morphle, the T-Rex hurt his knee. Morphle, morph into an ambulance. A big dinosaur ambulance. I don't think this is quite big enough. Morphle, morph into a crane. Professor Receipt's time machine. We are unstoppable. <laughs> we have to stop them, Morphle. Morph into a dinosaur superhero. Can't do any more damage. No, wait! This is not how it's supposed to happen! Let's get them all together so I can zap them back into prehistoric times. Quickly, pick up the Triceratops, Morphle. <laughs> I think you forgot one dinosaur! <laughs> oh no! Morphle! <laughs> Quick! To the lab! We need to find out where he went! Tubes. Hang on, Morphle! That 
it should do it. I'm so glad you're okay. Sammy, you can win this race. Hey, Builder Lawrence, what's wrong? My little Sammy doesn't want to do this race anymore because the big dogs are being mean to her. Poor Sammy. <laughs> Good job, Barky. Mean. Look. <laughs> hmm. That's it, Morful. Let's play with Sammy so she doesn't think you are scary anymore. That was our ball. Can we have it back? <laughs> Is it? Well, finders keepers. If you really want to have it back, then why don't you try taking it? Morph, morph into a T-Rex. of participants.
tumbling test tubes, I accidentally dropped this life ray that I was going to present at the National Science Conference, and it zapped your toy dinosaurs to life. But it broke, and I can't zap the dinosaurs back again. Hmm. Mila, can you look after them while I fix my life ray? Of course, Professor Rashid. I'm sure we'll have lots of fun together. Great. I'll be back as soon as I can. Okay, toy dinosaurs, while we wait for the professor to return, let's play a game! longer than expected, but it's fixed now. Let's go back to the toy dinosaurs right away. I hope nothing bad has happened while I was gone. Oh, tumbling test tubes. Professor, do you want to join the picnic? We've been having great fun! Thank you, Mila, but I think it's time to zap the dinosaurs back into toys. Steady. Oh. Professor Rashid, I don't think the toy dinosaurs want to go back to being toys. They've been having much more fun as living dinosaurs. Yes, Mila, but the city is no place for dinosaurs. Hmm. Oh, I have an idea. Maybe Zookeeper Kenneth has a place for them. Wow! What? 
What's this? Are those giant toy dinosaurs? Yeah. Professor Rashid accidentally zapped them with his life ray. Do you have a place for the toy dinosaurs to live, Zookeeper Kenneth? Well, the zoo only has one place for big animals, and the elephants already live there. But during my travels, I think I spotted an uninhabited island where the toy dinosaurs could live. Let's go there right away, Morphle. There it is! You seem to have fun already! This island is a great home for you, but we need to go home again as well. Dinosaurs! Bye -bye. Celebrate the National Day of Dinosaurs! Professor Rashid has helped the city to organize a special dinosaur race! Wow, that's so cool! Let's join two Morphle. Morph into a T-Rex. But wait, we have another contestant. The winner of the race gets this beautiful award. Is everybody ready? Three. Two, one, go! <laughs> Let's compete too, Yorn. Yeah.
Stealing dinosaurs, huh? Not in my city. Oh. Congratulations to the winners! We didn't win, Morphle, but at least we have a fair winner. <laughs> I would love to have the chance to photograph a real live Tyrannosaurus. Morphle, morph into a time machine. And Morphle, a herd of Gallimimus. Wow! Ankylosauruses! Camera. my chance.
my camera. <laughs> <laughs>